Well, uh, I didn't really know what to expect by Type Paris when I applied. I just knew that I have this passion on type design and I wanted to pursue my, my, what I liked. And Type Paris was like really important for me, both for the uh, type design aspect because I improved and it gave me really a uh, strong knowledge that he's allowing me right now to continue my studies and to go deeper and deeper in what I like and what I want to do. But at the same time, as you can see, the place was unique because it gave me the opportunity to, to meet such people with whom I had and I have such a strong relationship with whom I shared my passion. I mean, it's, it's not easy to find someone that uh, he's interested in letters, in typography, in lettering, whatever. And for the first time of my life, I was with them, thinking, uh, speaking, thinking in the same way, speaking about like the same problems, struggling uh, with the same briefs. And it was like a life-changing experience, you know, because it's not, when you have someone with whom to share something, it's always like way better than work alone by, by your own. So yeah, Ted Paris was literally a crucial point of, for me at least, for one year after, one year after I, um, I'm back, <laughs> I'm back, yeah. And it's, uh, and it's quite strange being on the other side, but yeah, as I said, one year after Ted Paris hal he's al allowed me to, to continue my studies, to, to, to go deeper in what I like and to find my own way, to understand what I want to do and what I don't want to do, to understand uh, which is my way and which is not my way. Like, for example, there is this aspect of type design that I really like and this one that I don't really like, so I should go more in this way. But it's, it was really, really helpful and important for me. And the program has, has the teachers that are really special because it's not easy to uh, be really good at your job and at the same time be really good at teaching. And uh, I... I can I can say that these two guys and all the team from Tech Paris has, are really good at what they are doing. So trust them, even when you don't really understand why they are telling you something. That's very good advice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Ronald. Trust them. Uh, uh, can I have your account to send some money? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> no, um, trust them, but at the same time, like. Um, do what you like, because the best thing that no, it's okay. no, 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 no. What I really want to say is that the really the best things that you can do when you are school is being yourself, because in work you have clients, you have brief, you have you have limits. When you are at school, you can really express yourself without any kind of filter, and these guys are 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 here to allow you to do it. So trust them because what they really care about is you. So I'm done. Uh, my year's been quite different from his. <laughs> uh, I, when I was accepted to type Paris, I was very excited mainly to spend the summer in Paris. And then when I was at Type Paris, I did not see Paris one bit. <laughs> and um, that just reaffirmed to me that it was the life-changing experience that I needed. And um, in doing so, it's helped me to understand my uh, desires for typography, uh, specifically how they apply to my profession and um, how I apply that every day to selling my work to my clients. And uh, over the past year, I've had the, 
I've had a really interesting and awesome journey of um, starting a company, which is Lobster Phone, my little one-person company. Um, and uh, been able to create over 32 brands over the past year. And it's been a real feat. And uh, in knowing that I was able to do that was mainly because of the knowledge that I gained, uh, not just here, but you know the, the camaraderie and um, the continuous camaraderie because we have a WhatsApp channel that we never stopped using uh, from the day that we had joined Type Paris to literally today. Um, we change it occasionally and the photo changes. Sometimes it's you, sometimes it's you. <laughs> Sometimes it's something really strange. But um, the, the point is is that uh, we send each other our work occasionally and get feedback. And we've created such a strong bond that it does surpass certain limits of friendship and uh, professional relationship that you can't quite create in any other sort of network. So I do find it to be quite unique. And um, the experience of going through, through something so grueling uh, together in very close quarters in very hot temperatures um, with very um, professional, regimented, and adamant people uh, really makes you close to the ones that you're next to. So I, um, I couldn't really have done this past year without that experience. I'll just keep this. Okay, it's all said, so I will be short. On one hand, it gave me much more skills to be more confident by my myself, like designing kind of lettering pieces or whatever, not typefaces, but logotypes or whatever for my clients. But on the other hand, I realized myself that uh, type design is so complex, so the more you learn, the more you know that it's so far to, to know all the to have the capacity to design a typeface. But it's great to, to have this uh, click on your mind and to be aware of what, what, can, what is coming if you learn more and more and just try to practice and to draw every day or if, you, if it's not every day but at least once per week, whatever. And of course, uh, the I mean, the personal uh, relationship that we made, it was great. This, that's why we are all here again, so this is the proof. <laughs> and yeah, it was great. 